Welcome to Good Park. Thank you very much. Story Manager. How are you doing? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I've been making whiskey for 28 years and it's the first time I've been involved in something like this. I know it's a, it's a brand new project and a new concept. And I think for us to be asked and personally myself to be asked, uh, it's, it's pretty special. Thank you. When, when he first explained it to me, what a great idea. What Hernan has done, he sent us various different types of rum, very different strengths, various different ages for us to fully experiment with and play with. Well, the quality of the rum is just fantastic. Thank you. Our water at the distillery comes from natural spring on the side of Ben Rennes. But you can see how clean it actually is. Just typical Scottish soft spring water. We can store up to 330 tonnes of malted barley at any one time. The malt that we're using is a variety called Concerto, and the majority of the beer is grown in Scotland. Our fermentation at Glenfartless is quite long. Normally in distilleries it'll be about 48 hours, and then they'll distill. At Glenfartless we ferment for over 70 hours all the time. And we're the only distiller in Scotland still to fire all our stills directly using flame, which gives us a lot of flavour profile. I had the great honour, great privilege to go to Columbia um, to visit Hernan's distillery. When we did start sitting down and talking about old rum, old whiskey, the flavour profiles were remarkably similar. The, the flavours, the fruits, the nuts, the dryness, the, the citrus tones, they were all there in like, you know, 40 year old whiskey, but you were also getting it in 40 year old rum as well. The way they make the whiskey is a very simple way, the same way that we do the rums. Behind a good spirit, it's simplicity. Amazing. You get that nice sweet barley note, and then you'll start to get that nice fruity note that we had at fermentation. Absolutely. So that's the flavour profile coming through the spirit. What Callum is doing, he is really at the end of the day bringing a little bit of his essence into the world of Glenfarclas. Do you know, I just love my job to be honest. I've got one of the best jobs in the world. I get to meet nice people, I get to go to nice places, and I work in a fantastic distillery with a great team of guys. Glen Farkless is one of only three historically family-owned distilleries still in existence. I mean, we're distilleries that are more than 100 years old. So this is some of the casts that just came in from Spain today. Some of them are very similar to what we've done with the rum. And let you have a little nose at it. Okay, just pull that out. And smell that. Oh, this is amazing. Aging is the most important process for us, for any of our companies. Yeah. Because after 12, 20, 25, 30 years, we will get the best spirit from this cask. So hopefully the maturation of this type of cask will give the rum that Glenfartless taste profile. to it, profile. We're very fortunate here at Glenfartless to have some very, very old warehouses. Some of our warehouses are over 200 years old. And these warehouses were really built to last. So the oldest ones are here. Okay. These buildings date back to around about 1836. I can smell the rum from here. This is warehouse one. Uh, this is where we keep some of the oldest whiskey we have at Glenfartless. Some of it dates back to 1953. And we've actually used a cask from here from your rum, which dates back to 1968. So it's a 50-year-old cask, which should give us some character. There's around about 4,000 casks in this area, and on site we can hold up to 100,000 casks. So you can lock me in and come for me in a few months. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I could lock you in, but I would have to uh, probably stay with you just to make sure that you were drinking the right quality of stuff. This is a cask here that we've used for the rum project and we've sort of married them off. So we've got like a 1978 rum and we've put that in a fresh sherry whiskey cask that's held whiskey for 50 years. Today I saw them doing the whiskey with passion, with love, which is the most important ingredient and with a, with a traditional system, uh, which is really impressive, really clean. I am really pleased and really Good. impressed with the, with the distillery, with the similarity that we have together between Victor and Ben Farkless, in the way we age, in the way we, we take care of our products. I hope that in the near future we can get together and drink a few bottles of the rum that will come out from these barrels. It's been a pleasure working with you guys. I look forward to watching it over the next few months developing and then letting you know that Right, that's it, done. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much.